this is Jetsy. Jetsy from Chicago. Are you responsible for this sign, you son of a bitch? Because if you are, Jetsy's going to come down to the New York land and shove a big ass crap, dog shit, New York style pizza down your goddamn throat, you motherfucker. You don't mess with Jetsy. Don't mess with Chicago, son of a bitch. Never call me jerky. I told you never fucking call me jerky. Never. I don't have anything to throw right now, guys. Well, I'll just make a big violent outburst later, you son of a bitch. This is Jaku K team. K team, like salt team. I don't know what you talking about, no sign, boy. I didn't make no sign about jerky. Well, let me see here. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I got you, Jersey. I mean, j jerky. You ain't nothing but a pile of jerky, you son of a bitch. You better stay out of Chicago. That's why I did that sign. Keeping your jerky, turkey, and Capicola ass out of here. Get out of here, boy, you jerky motherfucker. Hey, hey this, this is Jimmy. I got your... Your messenger from a guy named Dolly Jackbook. He said you were 16. He said you're beautiful. I just wanted to get to know you. My name's Jimmy. <laughs> I hope you don't find me disturbing. Because I'm just looking for some love. And I like the In all the wrong places, buddy. <laughs> Dolly Jackbook's a great guy. He must be a good friend. He said to give you a call because you're lonely. Anyways, I gotta go now. Come to me back when you get a chance. Uh. Well, boy, this is Canary Pete. I see right through you, sir, Jolly Jack. Fuck. Send these gold diggers to come find your money. Well, it ain't gonna work, pal. It ain't gonna work there, Kimmy, Jimmy, Bobimmy. Where the hell you are? You ain't finding you ain't finding this location of a can of repeats. Lost fortune. I know we say it's Jelly J. Fox, but it's all can it repeats now. Can it repeats gold. Can it repeats Monopoly money. Can it repeats golden pickles. I got it all, fucking. You ain't getting none of it. <laughs> you can send your hoes after me all you want, but you ain't gonna find this location of this can the can it pick, pick, pickle compound, boy. So get lost, you motherfucker. Jetsy from Chicago. Heard it was your birthday the other day. Well, happy motherfucking birthday, you son of a bitch. Goddamn can repeat pickling bastard. I'm surprised you haven't pickled the damn United uh, the Statue of Liberty by now. God damn it. <laughs> Working on it. Soon. I want to see that shit in the news. I know it's you. Pickled the Statue of Liberty. Well, anyways, uh, happy birthday, motherfucker. I see you. Jersey won't forget. Jersey hasn't forgotten shit. Jersey's gonna find you. Jersey's gonna shove a Chicago style pizza up your ass. Well, boy, this is good old Canary Pete. And, and I had a wonderful birthday. Thank you, boy. You know, I actually went to Chicago, had me a deep dish pizza. And I actually went around, and I had a little time later on, maybe that week. I went to Jolly Jack Fuck's area. He doesn't know I was there, but I was watching him a little bit. Man, he is fucked up. He's doing all sorts of fucked up stuff. And then some. So I had your Chicago deep dish, not to say Jersey. It's so terrible. I just want to stick your face in it, you motherfucker. Well, thanks for the birthday wish. I appreciate it. And Jolly Jack Fuck is a regular. He is a fucking asshole, but... I have his money now, so I don't care. I'm going back to being a, a triple pickle millionaire. Thank and one more thing, boy. Maybe I'll have you around the old pickle mansion sometime. But you don't be acting a fool, like 
Jolly Jack fucking start burning shit up and acting like a regular jackass. You hear that, boy? You come over to Cannery's place. You expect a little class, you motherfucker. Well, thanks a lot for the birthday wish. You come out over sometime, boy. You know, I'll take I'll take good care of you. You'll have pickled carrots, pickled pork chops, you name it. I'll, I'll hook you right up, boy. You take care of there, you old son of a bitch, you jersey, you, you, you fucker. You take care. You're, you're one good son of a bitch, huh? I'll see you, boy. Take care, boy. This is a message for Jersey. Well, I hope uh, you leave enough room for my fist so I can wrap it in your stomach and break your goddamn spine. Hello, my friends. This is Rafiki at Rafiki's Carpet Lounge. Well, boy, this is Cannery P, and we support Jolly Jack Fuck 2020. That's right, boy. 2020 is going to be a year for Jack Fuck. Well, I'm in it for good. I'm in, we're in it to win it. That's right. Namaste, my friend. This is Greg Butler, the great Marty Bar. Money taco bodyguard and I support Jolly Jack Fuck for President 2020. Cannery told me to. You know, hell, I don't need Cannery's endorsement or money. I want you, fuck. You're the greatest fucking thing alive. You go get him, boy. This is Jolly Jack Fuck here from Texas. I got a big announcement for everyone to hear. I've got the almighty Montgomery Tar Heel backing me up on my 2020 presidential campaign to make this not America great again, but to make America Texas. Texas-sized America. We're going to take our, our tractors, lawn equipment, whatever, cranes, bulldozers. We're going to shape America just like Texas. Because Texas is a great country in its own. And I figure, once it's shaped like Texas, we'll all get along. We will all get along. Some people won't see the reasoning, but they just don't understand until you're part of that Texas. Charlie Jack, fuck here. Great announcement. Look forward to the 2020 elections. Charlie Jack, fuck for the people. I don't know. I think we stopped recording. Anyways, I have <laughs> those goddamn stupid son of a bitch liberal goddamn Americans. We're going to put a cowboy boot right up all their asses. Yep, that's right, son. We're going we're gonna to get some chewing tobacco and just spit on all their faces, the ones that don't comply. We're going to say, get the hell out of Texas, which is will be America that time. America, Texas. Texas, America. We'll figure some name out for it. If they don't want to comply to Texas rules, they can get the hell out of Jolly Jack Fuck's Texas. Hey. Hey. This is Jetsy. Jetsy from Chicago. I heard you've been playing Borderlands 3 and you got farther than me. Or getting far, getting caught up or far, I don't know which one. Let me tell you something. Nobody gets farther than Jetsy on Borderlands 3. When people get farther than Jersey on Borderlands 3, I get all kinds of New Jersey style angry. Chicago, sorry. Forgot where I was. Ignore that. Shut up. God damn it. This is Jersey. Jersey from Chicago. That alone should scare you to shit your own pants. Jersey from Chicago. Beat me at Borderlands 3. Get ahead of me. I will beat your ass. I think a pickled armadillo would beat you at Borderlands there, Jersey. Onward with the messages. Well, boy, this is can of repeat here. And you bet your pickles, you dumb son of a bitch. I did get farther at Borderlands 3. I've been getting all sorts of I did all the quests, all the challenge maps, boy. What you been doing? Sit on your ass? Play with your pud in a Chicago alley somewhere, boy? You gotta get on that, boy. You gotta catch up the old pen or can or pee here. You want a little backward southern guy like me being you, do you there, Jersey? 
Uh, and calm right down there, boy. You don't want to give you, you want to have high blood pressure with good old can of repeat there. So you calm down, boy. You get ahead, concentrate, get your head out of that goddamn trash can, and, and catch up to me at Borderlands 3, boy. There'll be consequences, like a big pickle throwdown, boy. Oh, yeah, boy. This is old can of repeat. And I'm telling old pickle camp stories for the holidays, for Halloween. A long time ago, there was this pickle monster. And it, it irritated everybody. I mean, everybody was afraid of it. The campfire, little kids would be afraid of it. It went around, you know, terrorizing people and driving people nuts. So one day, great, 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 great uncle Cannery Montgomery Pete goes up there. He sees that thing trying to go after a little kid. And he, he grabs his, like, his straps, his ancient straps, hog ties his around his throat and kills that pickle monster dead. The end, sucker. Hello. This is Jiku Keteen. Keteen. Like saltine. I want to tell you about the great Chicago pizza monster of 1910. This, this is a deep dish monster. He went around terrorizing all these this pizza shops. I mean, he, he must have drove, I think he even drove Jersey's family nuts. I mean, they went around and finally, good old Jersey times 10 removed grandfather or something he goes and takes his sucker down he would know about it but you know boy i mean we have rap songs about him in chicago it's so bad this this fucking chicago deep dish piece of monster is horrible boy come on well, that's all i got for today this is jetsy jetsy from chicago i remember this goddamn pickle Pickle monster stories when I was a little kid in Jersey, Jer Chicago. Son of a bitch. It's the only thing in this goddamn place that scares Jersey is the pickle monster. When I go into a grocery store and I see a jar of pickles, I ain't getting near that shit. And if I get near that shit, I st Jersey has been kicked out of retail stores and arrested for smashing jars of motherfucking pickles. All right? I don't even give a shit. You get so pissed off, I'll start smashing on people's heads. That's right. Jersey will smash a jar of pickles on random people's heads. Cause I ain't gonna deal with no pickle monster. This is Jolly Jack Book from Texas. I'm running for the 2020 presidential candidates. And I teamed up with Cannery Pete and Montgomery Tar Heel as well as some guy named after a cracker. I can't got this. Saltine something. <laughs> Anyways, Jolly Jack Fuck says, for Halloween, I'm going to dress up as a giant pickle <laughs> in honor of these good fellas. <laughs> and also, I'll send out some gift cards and some business cards for Rafiki's Carpet Lounge. Go Rafiki. Support my 2020 presidential c candidacy. And don't you, I don't want people calling me a big green dick, okay? I am not a big green dick. I am a pickle, a canned pickle. Anybody gets it wrong, John Jeff, I'll have him executed. That's the way of the United States of America. That's how it should be. Vote John Jeff, fuck, 2020. Hey, this is Jetsy. Jetsy from Chicago. What are you doing, motherfucker? You ain't gonna descend. You're gonna descend into the toilet. Down into the sewers of New York City with them crocodiles, motherfucker. Yo, this is Jersey. I'm, you know, Chicago versus New York. New York's a piece of shit compared to Chicago, all right? That damn carpet lounge, motherfucker. You didn't sell that. You couldn't sell that to a goddamn flea market, let alone a fucking thrift store, motherfucker. Hey, this is Jersey talking shit, because... Jitsi's an asshole, and I don't care. Jitsi take pride in being a motherfucking asshole, okay? That's why oh, I gotta go, man. Probation time, motherfucker. I'll be back. <laughs> this is Rafiki's carpet lounge. You talking shit about my carpets? 
I'll roll you in, more, motherfucker. I'll send you down Seaworthy, down the street. You know my boy. I got one more visitor for you right now. Well, boy, this is good old Ganner Pete. I'm gonna, I'm gonna send in all right. I'm gonna send in a pickle straight up your fucking ass, Jersey. You can take that to the bank. It'll clean your cone real good. Southern Gotham City rules. New York rules. Go back to Chicago, boy. Man, you must have had that carpet coronavirus. He sounds terrible, that, that Rafiki does. Onward to the messages. Jerky turkey and pork in Chicago or New York. Come on down to my side of Chicago town and I'll beat your ass to the ground. Sign on, bitch. Hey, this is Jetsy. Jetsy from Chicago, son of a bitch. I hear this game flex coming after me. What oh, motherfucker, bring it on. I'm gonna come over there to Gotham City. I'm beat the fucking shit out of you, Chicago, Chicago style, you motherfucker. Ain't nothing gonna harm Jersey. The only thing that's gonna harm Jersey is be getting probation and not being able to kick your motherfucking ass. What's gonna hurt Jersey? That's the only thing that's gonna stop me, you son of a bitch. Jersey on to you, motherfucker. Jersey prepared. Jersey, Jersey from Chicago has got it all under control. You motherfucking gay black. Looking at your last motherfucking day right now, motherfucker. <sighs> this is Gabe Fleck. I hear you, Jersey. I hear you've been in all sorts of trouble. Especially around Gotham City. I know you are a Gotham thug. You're almost as bad as the book or, or the polar penguin. I must take you down. You are the worst criminal thug in Chicago, and I must put you in the Arkham Asylum because you're just too crazy for this world. So when I come and see you and lock you up, I'm going to break down your fucking door. some of the pickled millions I stole from you. I'll support you in this race, Jolly. I just wanted to warn you. I killed Kebab's back, and he's dangerous. You he might even go after a rich thug like me, or a rich, rich old pickle, you know, I don't know what you'd call me, a pickle man like me, but he also go after a guy like you, so you better watch your back. I killed Kebab's back, and he's going to cut off your nuts for eating bacon. If you're watching, boy, that's all I'm saying. You know, Jolly Jack Book 2020. Yep, that rat bastard killed Kebab's back. And he's more dangerous than ever. Next message. Yes, sir. This is uh, Larry uh, from the Chicago PD. Uh, I have a gentleman here named Jersey. He's from Chicago. He says, you or somebody you hired shot him up in the laundromat Chicago the other day. So uh, I want to get to the bottom of this, ask you a few questions, if you would, sir. Um, I need to get to the bottom of this right away. He, he claims uh, you made him miss probation because of the shots, and he he wants damages. So he, he was pressing charges against you, can repeat. Uh, give me a call back as soon as possible. Next message. Hey, this is Jetsy. Jetsy from Chicago. You son of a bitch. I know you shot at me, you motherfucker. This is this is war. Jetsy, Jetsy got shot in the goddamn shoulder. I'm gonna come to New York and fuck your shit up, Chicago style, motherfucker. Who is 
is. Is this the Chicago Beanie Boys? What the hell? I lived in Southern Gotham City. Why would I be in, in Chicago? Are these cops nuts or something, boys? I'm sitting here with my pickle millions, fake pickle in it in, in my kitchen, and they ask me if I'm shooting up Jersey. I absolutely did it, boy. I made I invented a new pickle gun. You'll never catch me alive, coppers. Well, boy, see you later. <laughs> You'll never get me catch me alive. I knew it. This Jersey from Chicago. I knew it, you son of a bitch. Shoot me with pickles. Oh, that's it. Jersey's gonna get some Jersey Chicago style revenge on your ass, motherfucker. Okay, Jersey got planned. Jersey's gonna hire the pickle catcher. What do you think about that? Like a dog catcher, but it's the pickle catcher. You just be on the lookout, boy. Jersey's coming for you. Oh, yeah, boy, Jersey. <laughs> the pickle catcher, huh? I'm shaking my fucking boots over here, pal. You gonna give me, you gonna silence my new revolutionary technology pickle gun? I think not, boys. And I got two straps to defend myself, so you're in trouble, boy, if you're coming down to Southern Gotham City. But, you know, I will, I lie, boy. I got those pickled millions. I shipped up myself to Chicago, and I spent a few weeks there waiting to see where you live. And I found your ass and shot you with my pickle gun. Case closed. Suck on my pickle gun, motherfucker. Hey, this is Jancy. Jancy from Chicago, motherfucker. I like, why ain't you made no videos, you son of a bitch? You afraid of Jancy? You afraid Jancy's on the prowl to get you? I can't even talk, motherfucker. Jancy's got to go to probation, son of a bitch. Jancy's going to kick your ass. I'm going to come there to New York with the Chicago-style pizza and make you eat that motherfucker. You probably like it, though. That probably, that'd probably be treating you to something good, eh? Jesse ain't doing that shit. Mm -hmm. The hell you think you are? You ain't deserve no Chicago-style pizza. Fuck you, man. Hey, this is Hardethrov Kuchevik here. Long time, my comrade. I have seen this Jersey fellow. He must be dealt with quickly. He cannot have this for Putin, for Kremlin. He must be taken care of. We have not accept this kind of threat. Do you understand me, comrade? You must take care of the situation immediately for Kremlin, for Putin, for Trump. Do me a favor, okay? Take care of this asshole. It must be done. How does of Gucci pick out? Wait. So as in keep fucking all We'll be back on there soon, boy. I promise. We'll deal with your ass. I pro we'll knock your ass down. We'll gun you down in the goddamn parking lot. <laughs> oh man. We we did like the fucking almost did over there in the laundry man. Like, it would be the worst, buddy. You can imagine. All my straps are falling off. I gotta get going, oh man. <sighs> Stefanowski, great history, terror of all time. Yes, my friend, I better get off my my, car, my American Kremlin ass and do something about this Jersey. He's a disgustingness to Trump. He throws Trump, he's so an idiot. He throws his policies and down the garbage with this moronacy. We must take him out, my comrade. I'll, I'll keep in touch with you soon. Wait Saturday, I'll have a video. I hope you enjoyed.
they give like messages.